Yo, what's up guys, it's Ryan, and today I'm bringing you a, uh, a short little video on humanizing contact or sample-based instruments. So, right here I've got a super simple, like, sort of jazz piano melody. Uh, let's listen. super basic super simple but it sounds very bland and very kind of flat and that's because obviously in the real world it's almost impossible to hit every note with the same intensity and force uh that you did like the other notes so like in here if you look the velocity of all of these notes are exactly the same so what you can do to fix that is you can go in by hand and like change them around and like make them all different and whatever but that's that's a lot of work so if uh if you want to do it quickly and easily and automatically what you can do is go into midi effects grab this velocity plugin right here drag and drop it on and then in here you can take the random and increase it and now you can see right here on this line there's the middle line is the velocity that the note already has and then the gray like outline is now the area that the area of velocity that it can have and you can take the out and put it down just so it doesn't get like crazy loud and hard but now you have Obviously, it's not perfect because it's automatic, um, but it is a lot better. It it does it does make the sound uh, a a lot more realistic and a lot more convincing. The next step to this would be going in and just like it's so hard to play consistently on like velocity wise, timing wise. There's no way you play it on the grid exactly every time like i don't care how much you practice i don't care how much like you're prepared there's no way you're this like precise so the next step would be coming in and taking like the notes and like moving them just a little bit but again takes a lot of work uh, but that's just like the next step the first step you can do is like doing this to the velocity and then The timing might still be perfect but odds are you're watching this making edm music so like you don't you're not trying to convince the world that it's like an actual human playing you just want it to sound a little more like it you know so yeah that's my quick tip for today uh if you got any questions be sure to let me know i'd be sure i'd be i'm more than happy to answer them and uh hope this helped. Hope you learned something. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.